Hello everyone, welcome back to Crafting with Janine. Today I'm going to show you how I like to make these super cute present bows. This one here is using 5 8 inch wide ribbon and it measures a little over 3 inches wide. This one here is using 7 8 inch wide ribbon and that one measures about 4 inches wide. And this big one here is using inch and a half wide ribbon and that measures about five inches wide and it's really big so it's five by it's basically five by five and it's pretty big but some might like it and it's really cute so like this you can do them any way you like like this one I did the three different colored ribbons or this I just did all the same ribbon they're so easy and simple to make that I actually make them and because you can use whatever ribbon, but I make them and put them on my presents for my kids. So we're going to do the 7 8 inch one today. And you're going to need three pieces cut to 7 inches long. Three pieces cut to 6 inches long. And one piece cut to 3 inches long. So I'm going to start with my 7 inch pieces. And... I know some like to sew them. I find this way easier. It's so easy to do it this way. So what I do is I take my piece, I fold it in half just to find my middle, and then I take a little bit of glue, and I put it right there. And then I'm going to take my end, I always work from the bottom, and then fold that up so we get this look here. So there's that, and then I just push it into place. And then I turn it around. And then you're just going to put a little bit of glue right here along that line. And then this one you're going to fold up this way. So, ultimately, this is what your end result is. And we're going to do that for all of them. So, I'm just going to go through and bounce through them. And get them done. I'm going to go quiet here for a minute. But these are so cute, and you can do this with, like I said, any type of ribbon. You can do these these with gift wrap ribbon. You just cut them to your desired length for whatever width you're using. And you can make your own bows for your presents. It kind of personalizes your Christmas gifts even more underneath your tree. And then you just kind of make sure, like, my kids know to save their bows so that we use them for the next year. Or you can put a clip on them and put them on presents that you're giving out to nieces and nephews, or, or nieces, not nephews. They won't want a bow. But, and then it kind of makes it even more of a Christmas present that way. Okay, so now I've got my three seven inch pieces done. So now what we're going to do is you kind of want the first two to overlap just a little like that so that they make this X like this. You don't want them like this because you got to put the third one in. You want the first two you put over like that. I know I keep shaking you guys. My cords are tangled. So here we go. So that's what we're looking for right there. And then we're going to put another big blob of glue in there. And then this one, we're going to kind of not necessarily put it in the middle and half cock it just a bit. So that our base, that's our bottom one. And we look like this. So now we're going to do the same thing. Okay, because I had a brain fart. I told you the measurements a little wrong. So it's actually three 8 inch pieces and three 7 inch pieces. I was thinking of the 5 8 inch bow when I said those measurements. So, but I will put the measurements for each bow down in the description. So this one's my top one, this one's my smaller ones, and these are my larger ones. Okay. 
I am sorry. But, so just keep in mind for your 7 8 inch wide ribbon, you're going 3 8 inch pieces and 3 7 inch pieces. But once again, I will put the measurements in the description below. So, we're just going through. So easy, so simple. No fuss, no muss. So we're going to do the same thing with these ones as we did with the other ones. Get rid of all my strings. Use the big boy for this one. And we're just going to kind of make our X that way. Blob. And just kind of half cock it that way. So we don't want it right, right in the middle. And then we're just going to put a big old blob of glue right in here. And then what you want to do when you're putting these together is you kind of want to make sure your little... These parts go in the, the gaps of the other ones, which is why we put them together the way we do. So that everything kind of fits right in where you want it. And then for our little piece here, we're just going to make a circle. So what I do is I just put a little line of glue right here on the end. And then I just pull my end up. Just a little bit. Just enough to connect it and make a circle with it. And then we put some glue. My glue gun wants to warp. Need some glue in there. And then you put him right in the middle there. And there we have it. Cute little present bow. So cute, so simple, and so easy to make. So, here we have it. All of our bows, and I just knocked you guys. I am so, so sorry. Let me slide you back over because I bumped you hard. There we go. So there we go, we have all our different little present bows and they're so cute. I hope you guys have fun with this one and it helps those needing to know. And don't forget to hit the thumbs up button and subscribe and tell your friends and I appreciate it. And you guys have a Merry Christmas and Happy Crafting.